Hey guys, so welcome back to Smartphone World. In this video, we are going to do a speed test between Redmi 5A and Moto C Plus, the two best budget smartphones of 2017. To my left, we have Moto C Plus, the current best budget smartphone from Lenovo, and to my right, we have the best entry level budget smartphone from Xiaomi, the Redmi 5A. Moto C Plus runs stock Android, whereas Redmi 5A runs Android 7.1.2 with Mi UI 9 on top. Moto C Plus is powered by 1.3 GHz quad core MediaTek MT6737 chipset with 2 GB of RAM. On the other hand, Redmi 5A is powered by 1.4 GHz Snapdragon 425 quad core processor with 2 GB of RAM. To be slightly fair, I chose only simple games and apps for the speed test. Both the phones are connected to the same Wi Fi and all background running apps have been cleared. So let's get started. First off, let's open some system based apps. Let's start with the phone dialer. As you can see the Redmi 5 loads the phone dialer slightly faster, maybe by a split second. Let's open another system based application which is settings. And both the phones open the app at the same time. Now let's move on to some third party applications. Let's open Instagram and as you can see both the phones load the app at the same time. Now let's open Video Show, a video editing app that I personally use. And you can see Redmi 5 loads the app faster than Moto C+. Now it's time to test some games. Let's start with Stack. As you can see, Redmi 5A loads the game slightly faster than Moto C+. We can see the power of Snapdragon 425 chipset when loading games. The same happens with Subway Surface, Alto and other games. The Snapdragon 425 chip loads the game faster than cheap MediaTek processor. Now let's open camera and Redmi 5A loads the camera also faster. Let's open YouTube. As you can see, Moto C Plus loads YouTube faster than Redmi 5A. Now it's time to do some browsing test. As you can see, Redmi 5A loads Android Authority website slightly faster than Moto C Plus. Now let's check out the RAM management of both the phones, the crucial part of this speed test. Redmi 5A miserably fails in this round. In both the phones, we have Google Chrome loaded in memory, YouTube and camera are also in memory. Now when I try to reload Alto, the Moto C Plus loads the app directly without refreshing the game. On the other hand, you can see Redmi 5A reloading the game. The same happens with Subway Surfers and other games as Redmi 5A reloads the game while Moto C Plus keeps the game in memory. So let's check Instagram and as you can see Redmi 5A reloads the app again. To conclude, Redmi 5A has faster Snapdragon 425 processor that helps Redmi 5A to load games and apps faster. It is better than Moto C Plus but fails in memory management. Moto C Plus with Media Core MediaTek processor has better RAM management thanks to stock Android which helps Moto C Plus to keep more apps loaded in memory. However, in my opinion, the winner of the speed test is Redmi 5A. It loads apps and games faster and still keeps 4 to 5 apps in memory. That's it for this speed test. So, what do you guys think about Redmi 5A performance? Share your thoughts on the comment section. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up button and I'll be making a full comparison of Redmi 5A and Moto C. So, stay subscribed to Smartphone World to get the update once the video goes on air. As always, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video and you guys have a great day.